What is up guys, Cog Gameplay here, and today's video I'm showing you the best SMG in Black Ops 2, and that is the MSMC. This gun is an absolute monster. So I posted the best gun in Black Ops 2 yesterday, and that was the M881, but I think it is a very, very, very close toss-up, depending on what type of player you are. If you're a running gun sort of player, you want to get into their spawn, get lots of close range kills, this gun is the gun for you. If you want to sit back, pick off people, um, get your kill streaks while playing maybe Domination or TDM and not Kill Confirmed, Kill Confirmed, have to run an SMG like the MSMC and you will destroy. Get all the tags you can and you'll get tons of kill streaks. And so, um, what makes this gun so good is the statistics. The statistics of this gun compared to all the SMGs is really different. It is a very, very high powered SMG with a lower rate of fire and a very, very low recoil. So it is really easy to control the recoil to long distance, especially with a long barrel. This gameplay that I got was I think around the fourth or fifth game that I've ever played with the, uh, the MSMC. But since playing with it, I've got over a thousand kills with the gun. And I can say that the best loadout to use would be the fast mag, long barrel, and adjustable stock. That combination is insane. Stock is like Stalker from Modern Warfare 3, and if you don't know what that is, you actually strafe left and right, which is moving left and right while you're aiming down sight faster. And because not many people use it, when people are getting in gunfights with you and you're strafing left and right at the same speed as you're walking forward, it really throws off the enemy. And lots of times, you can actually predict and you can kill them moving because you know exactly where you're going to go with that strafe. They have no clue. And so it makes it really difficult at times for people to kill you. And it keeps you alive in a lot of one-on-one -on -one circumstances. So I would highly, highly recommend the stock. The fast mag is a must because, well, this only has a 30 mag clip. And because of that, you're going to be reloading a lot. You can use extended mags if you really want, but personally, I like reloading the gun really fast. To be in gunfights, I can pop behind cover, reload, and get out of cover and kill them again. And so I like the fast mags the best. And the next is the long barrel, which I think is an absolute must. This thing is like a stopping power for any SMG. It increases the range drastically. And while increasing the range, because the SMGs are only really good at close range, because it increases the range, it really increases the damage output over time. Because, let's just say for this, I would have not even got even half of his health there. But because I had the long barrel, I did more than half of his health. And so, um, it is it is just a must when using it. If you can get used to the iron sights of this gun, and you don't need to use the reflex sight or the EOD, you will be way better off, trust me. Try to get used to the iron sights and it will benefit you greatly. Another thing is that I really don't like using silencers on the SMGs. I feel that whenever you put a silencer on it, it hinders the damage way too much. And so, in return, I like to just ride a uh, what I just told you instead of a silencer because a silencer not only decreases the range, but it also decreases the damage because of that. And you do not want to do that unless you're getting in really, really, really close confrontations that you're getting people from the side or back because one-on-one -on -one you might lose more often with a silencer. So getting into the statistics of this gun is a 30 round clip. Like I said, the damage is 40 to 18 depending on the distance, 40 at uh, 50 meters, up to 50 meters exactly. And so that is a three shot kill at up to 50 meters. Then next it goes to... Uh, 18 damage at a super long distance, which would be a 5 or 6 bullet kill at a very, very long distance. So, long distance, as you can see, the SMG isn't that good, but short distance, this thing is a monster. The RPM is a bit lower than the average SMG, and it is 760. When you put rapid fire on it, I think it goes up to 900, and the reload is 2.07 seconds, and the raise time is 0.62 seconds. The average raise time of the SMG is 0.6. So 0 0.02 seconds to change in uh, race speed is nothing. It's undetectable by the eye. And the reload speed is around the average for a SMG, just a bit longer. So the fast mag does do a lot. The movement speed, speed like any other SMG, is 100%. And that is why I love running lightweight 
So here is a, an example of my best class that I really recommend using. If you guys have never tried this, please do try it out. You will do absolutely amazing, trust me. Trust me on this. Lightweight, scavenger, dexterity. So you're running around super fast with SMG. You have stocks, you're even strafing really fast dexterity. Climb over any object really fast. You're just a absolute rushing machine and you will do tons of work. Next, going into the recoil, I'll show you guys. This is the reflex. As you can see, it is um, it is all right. You can kind of control it. A couple of bullets at the bottom and then most of it at the top. Next is the silencer and you'll notice that it actually goes up a lot farther. So it goes up a lot farther, the bullet spreads a bit more, and the damage is less. Then we have the grip, which really, really changes it and makes it really condensed. I like the grip. And last is the rapid fire, which is I, I would highly recommend not using unless you're playing super, super, super short range. So here it is, the reflex, the suppressor, the grip, and the rapid fire. Highly suggest sticking to the reflex grip and putting on that long barrel fast mag and adjustable stock whichever one grip is really good as well but uh, I think that I can stand that little bit extra recoil and uh, put on a stock or a long barrel anyways I'm called gameplay I hope you guys really did enjoy this video I put lots of effort in it, into it so if you guys did enjoy please do leave a like and a favorite and comment what you think your favorite SMG is in Call of Duty Black Ops 2 if you guys are new to my channel be sure to subscribe for the latest and greatest Call of Duty Black Ops 2 tips because I want every single person that subscribed to me to be the best player possible anyways I'm called gameplay and I'll catch you guys later have a great day peace